Hi, I'm Ms. Hearn. Let's get started. In this video, we're going to talk about how to create a graph. And this is a graph theory kind of graph that we're talking about, which represents the common boundaries in a map. So here we have a very rough sketch of a map of the northeastern region of India and the states within that region. Each state is marked with its official abbreviation, like AR, SK, AS. And what I'm going to do first is to write them separately from the map corresponding to the map and just create a vertex a point to represent each state a vertex for sk a vertex for ml and so on next i'm going to go state by state and draw a connecting edge between each state and any state that shares a common boundary with it for example going to ar here it shares a common boundary with as it also shares a common boundary with NL. So I'm going to connect AR to AS and connect AR to NL. Okay, and now I'm done with AR and I'm gonna move on to another state. So let's go to AS. We've already shown the connection between AS and AR. So let's look for any other common boundaries. So AS is also connected to ML. NL shares a common boundary, MN. MZ and it shares a tiny little common boundary with TR. So we have one, two, three, four, five more connections to draw between AS and other states. AS connected to NL, AS connected to MN, MZ, and so on. So now we're done with AS and we'll move on to another state. Let's try NL. We don't need to consider AR and AS because we've already formed connections to NL based on those. So we can just look at the states that we have not finished yet. So NL is sharing a boundary with MN and that's the only remaining state that it shares a boundary with. So we need to put in one edge between NL and MN. So we're done with NL. Let's look at MN. Again, only focusing on those states we haven't looked at yet. MN shares a common boundary with MZ and everything else is touching states we've already looked at. So we just need to connect MN to MZ. So now we're done with MN. Let's figure out which of the remaining states MZ shares a boundary with. So MZ shares a boundary with TR right here. And everywhere else, we're already looking at states that MZ has been connected to previously. So we just need to put in that one edge between MZ and TR. Then we're done with MZ. So we'll look at TR. TR is only connected to states that we've previously looked at, AS and MZ. So we're done with TR. Let's move on to ML. ML also only shares common boundaries with states we've already looked at, just AS. We're done with ML, we move on to SK, and SK is completely isolated from the other northeastern region states. We're done with our graph. Although I'd probably scoot that SK in. Remember, in graph theory, the lengths of the edges and the distances between the vertices are not important. It's only the connections between the vertices. And we have created a representation of all of those connections. I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. That helps other students to find the video.